How you doing? Seven Star Rank 3 is coming to MCOC. That is right. Seven Star Rank 3. You did not misheard me. Seven Star Rank 3 will be coming to MCOC. And you know, when I made my MCOC predictions for 2023, I expected maybe like a 50-50% chance that we'll get Seven Star Rank 3. But I was expecting it to be like December when the banquet event comes. You know, when people are like someone like Magus will willing to spend a hundred thousand dollars to get a seven star rank three. But now it's not even that. It's gonna be by October. Somebody will get a seven star rank three by October. So let's see how this this person get a seven star rank three. Basically, if you um you know place in the top eight summoners in what do you, in battlegrounds that means you get to have a chance to compete and go to Vancouver Canada to uh, to earn a seven star rank three a seven star rank three you know even a seven star rank two is has like a huge advantage against a, a six star rank five I believe it's like comparing a five star rank five to a six star rank three maybe even better because a six star a 5 star rank 5 has a higher combat power rate than a 6 star rank 3 versus when you compare a 7 star rank 2 to a five, uh, 6 star rank 5 would they have the same combat power rate also a 7 star rank 2 has what is called what stat focus which in could increase your attack as well so or I believe defensive ability as well so 7 stars have a huge advantage obviously uh, the only thing is when it comes to seven stars for now it's not going to be easy to awaken them and uh, you know have them have signature ability on them so that's the only thing that's going on right now that's saving six stars and you know when I said earlier when I made a video is six stars now worthless and wow it's it almost looked like it feels like it's going to be so sooner than expected with this uh, you know news that seven star rank three will have in October because you know when I said uh, the top one percent of one percent by cyber weekend that they're gonna be focusing on their seven stars which is one out of ten thousand it might even be the top I might be as go as far as a top one percent like the one out of a hundred people will be focusing on their seven stars by cyber weekend because there's really really a good chance that we're gonna have seven star rank three by Cyber Weekend, let's say maybe if you spend like twenty thousand, you buy all the offers or something like that. Not twenty thousand, like two thousand. When you buy all the offers, then you could get a seven star rank three. It might not be generic. It could be random, most likely random. But still, it's the seven star rank three, regardless. That is crazy, man. And it's just gonna push pretty play players or even just casual players way, way behind. Like it's like battlegrounds is like battlegrounds for the rich will be likely I mean that's how insane would that be if seven star rank threes comes in cyber weekend most likely will which is crazy a se you know a seven star rank three is like a what is that compare a five star rank five to a six star rank four that's like a six star rank five to a seven star rank three it attack wise and you know all those things wise and uh if you can make case even better actually it's even better yeah they have the same attack value pretty much you know uh, six star rank four has a 50% more attack than a five star rank five and a then a and a seven star rank three has 50% more attack than a six star rank five yeah you can say they're the same but not really because uh, for one thing uh, five star rank five has power gain advantage over a six star rank four where a six star rank five versus a seven star rank four they're equal when it comes to power gain advantage power rate advantage i should say and not only that seven stars have uh stat focus which increase your attack even more so you can almost pretty much compare uh, a seven star rank three to a six star uh a five star to a six star rank five from a six star rank five to a seven star rank three let me repeat that again you can it's really close to it's really close like a five star rank five is 
compared to a six star rank five it's almost like comparing a six star rank five to a seven star rank three it's that close so the gap between the two is just so crazy and obviously this will have been the gifting event i'm pretty sure uh it's gonna make some whales so happy of course and it's just gonna push their account so far you're gonna be up against seven star rank threes if you're playing battlegrounds i don't play battlegrounds as you know if you watch my channel uh, I stopped playing MCOC and uh, you know and all people especially pre play players and really I don't I don't really know why they're complaining about so much but you know people who spend money at least in the game they're complaining about bugs again on the game and then they're focusing on seven star rank threes I mean already it's so soon man I really think at the very latest earliest I mean that somebody should be getting seven star rank three by um uh, you know by banquet event like like they say that the first 30 you know one to top one to 30 so this is crazy to even man manage that seven star rank threes and if you're a pretty play player you can just forget about it you know there'll be more people with seven star rank threes the whales than any pretty play player with six star rank fives by january think about that more players with seven star rank threes than a six star rank five for pre to play players and six star rank five compared to seven star rank three is like comparing a five star rank five to a six star rank four actually better almost like comparing it to a six star rank five which is really crazy i mean this is like it's almost like kabam's desperate or something they want money for what i guess they want lots of money so they just want to focus on the whales it is pretty crazy that's what i think thank you